Welcome to the HANA Lab. My name is Doug, and today we're going to go over the waterproof GrowLine HI98131 Combo pH Conductivity and TDS Temperature Tester. This easy-to-use tester offers more value than any other comparable meter on the market, featuring two-button operation, automatic two-point calibration, and it has a replaceable probe. With an accuracy of plus or minus 0.1 pH and plus or minus 2% full-scale conductivity and TDS, this advanced waterproof tester is the tool for growers that rely on accurate measurements in their nutrient solutions. The GrowLine Combo Tester comes with everything you need to begin testing. Along with the tester comes our GrowLine Quick Calibration and Cleaning Solution Packets, Manual, and quality certificate. Before running out of these solutions, I recommend you check out our compatible products on our website. For this tester, I recommend our HI5036-023 bottle of quick calibration solution, the HI7061-023 grow line cleaning solution, and the HI70300-023 grow line storage solution. To set up your tester to your preferred settings, Press and hold the mode button for six seconds until you see the unit of measurement. Press the set hold button to choose between EC measurement or TDS factors of 0.5, 500 ppm, or 0.7, 700 ppm. Once you have chosen your preferred unit of measurement, press the mode button to choose your calibration type. By pressing the set hold button, you can choose between Cal Standard and Cal Quick. CalQuick allows you to use our GrowLine Quick Calibration Solution. This solution is for a one-point calibration in both pH and EC meters. It's like having two solutions in one bottle. Once you have your calibration type, press the Mode button again to choose your temperature settings. By pressing the Set Hold button, you will see the temperature units change from Celsius to Fahrenheit. Press Mode again and you can now choose your Auto Off setting. Pressing the set hold button will let you choose between 8 minutes, 60 minutes, or if you'd prefer, you can turn the setting off completely. Again, press the mode button once you have your preferred setting to return to measurement mode. Once all your settings have been set to your preference, the tester is now ready to be calibrated. Calibration is an important part of keeping your tester operating at its best. We recommend calibrating before each use. You can find everything for your tester at hannainstcom HI98131. To calibrate your meter, press the mode button for three seconds until Cal is displayed. If your tester is in the Cal Quick setting, first rinse the probe in distilled or deionized water. Place the electrode in your GrowLine Quick Calibration solution and wait for a stable reading. Once stable, the tester automatically goes back to measurement mode. Your tester also uses standard 4.01, 7.01, and 10.01 buffers. To calibrate your tester to two points, first, be sure you are in the Cal standard setting. Rinse in distilled or deionized water and place the tester in your HANA calibration buffer and wait for a stable reading. The tester automatically recognizes which one you use first. Once stable, it will ask you for the next buffer. Be sure to rinse your tester in distilled or deionized water and place it in the next buffer. Once recognized, the tester will go back to measurement mode and you are now ready to begin taking measurements. To get you started right away with best practices, here are some tips to follow for the best results. Clean your tester with the HANA HI7061-023 cleaning solution for 30 minutes at least once a week. Calibrate with HANA pH buffers before each use. Keep your probe conditioned with the HANA HI70300-023 storage solution. And the probe can be replaced with the HANA HI73127. So that's it. The GrowLine HI98131 Combo Tester is a simple to use tool for growers who need to test the pH and TDS of their nutrient solutions. You can find everything you need for your tester at hannainst.com slash HI98131. Buffers, solutions, and other products can be found right on the product page. Thanks for stopping by, and we hope you found this helpful. Don't forget to like us on Facebook and Instagram, and go ahead and click this little button down here to subscribe to the channel. If you want to learn more about this meter, click this box. See you soon.